guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another blog tech tips. And of course, guys, you're seeing the website here. And if you haven't visited the website already, please go over to www.blogtechtips.com. And today, guys, we're looking at this tutorial, guys. We have the write up already on the blog how to switch your laptop display between a projector or a second monitor. Now, this is great for those who actually um, have a presentation and you have a projector and you want to switch the display or in case your laptop screen is broken and it's not working. I'll show you two ways you can go about switching between a secondary display. As you can see here guys, this is my um, TV set. And of course, you'll need the HDMI cable or of course, if you have another connection. And of course, it's already connected to the TV. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna um, place this into the HDMI port, make sure it's set properly. So just go ahead and turn it accordingly. Forgive me guys, I'm trying to do this with one hand while holding the camera so what we're going to do is just place this in and there you go it's now in and of course you'll notice it will automatically switch in some cases but just in case it does not here's what you're actually going to do now guys right away you'll notice my display is trying to find the new source but do not watch that what we're going to do is we're going to switch the tv over to the correct input so for example let's say at the back of the TV, it's connected on the um, HDMI one. I'm going to hit source on the remote. And once I hit source, this should come up. And of course, you see HDMI, um, the secondary HDMI. I'm going to switch to HDMI one, which is the HDMI on which it's now on. So you can see it says HDMI one. And of course, right away, it automatically switch. Now, just in case it does not automatically switch, guys, I want to look on your keyboard and you'll look for the function key, which is the FN key. And of course, you can look for this one here, which is usually F5, it might change. But let's look out for the symbol that shows these two um, squares. And what you're gonna do is gonna hold on both function and of course, the F5 key. Now, I want you guys to look on screen. Something should come up. And there you go and it might come up on the laptop and I'm just gonna switch it just to show you what I'm talking about all right so you should start out somewhere like this so again in case you miss it just go ahead and hit the function key plus the F5 key and it should come up just like this and of course the options you'll have here is to duplicate if you're doing a presentation just choose duplicate what will happen is we'll show the same thing on the projector or the larger monitor um, as shown here and as well as here so you can do your presentation in case you just want to switch to a secondary display just go ahead and choose secondary display and of course this will go blank make sure to hit enter to select and of course you notice the display went blank while we are having the secondary display which could be a projector or a tv as in my case and look right over there you'll see and of course if i want i could um, extend and just hit enter again down here and extend basically switches or allows the desktop to be extended all the way across so if i were to move to the right or to the left um don't remember which side it will actually extend up here i could show you um if you look at the wallpaper down here sorry guys Whoa. you'll notice the cursor on screen moving right there and if i move it to one side it will actually come down here so both displays are merged as one all right and just in case you don't want to do that guys let's go ahead again function key and hit the button right there and to me um depending on what i'm doing i'll just use the second um display only and i'm just going to select second display only and there you go so i hope i've answered all your questions oh and just in case you want to do it from the pc side i totally forgot just go ahead and I'm just going to switch back to um, PC only and here we are so what I'm going to do is minimize and what we're going to do right here guys just um, right click and when I right click I'm going to go into um, display settings and once I'm in display settings you're going to go down Once you're here, next, 
is notice here it says multiple displays and all you gotta do here guys is just do the same thing these might be slightly different in um name but they work the same so you can use show and display too which will switch to the monitor if i were to select it um extend these displays will do the extension where both desktops are treated as one and it will work between both or duplicate these displays which will actually um replicate whatever is on the laptop screen on the secondary display so guys that has been basically how to switch between your displays to allow you to control what's going on and of course guys this should work um flawlessly um for you guys all right guys we got from black tech tips showing you how to actually go about um, switching between displays for various reasons if you have any comments or need direct help please use the comment section below it's regarding from black tech tips and bye until next time bye